Hello, my name is Dr. Frutman. I am a board certified psychiatrist. I am a medical director of Trifecta Health. Uh, today I would like to speak about ketamine. Ketamine is a new and exciting method of treating major depression. It's not yet FDA approved, but it appears to be a very safe and extremely rapid way to treat depression. What we know about depression and the models of depression that we have established with an interplay of serotonin, norepinephrine, and dopamine may actually have to be thrown out of the window entirely following the success uh, that many researchers have observed of ketamine treating non-responsive depression. So how does ketamine work? Well, exactly what it does to the brain and how that results in treatment of depression is not known yet for sure. The effect is immediate and obvious to most researchers, but we're still working on exact neuroscience models as to why this treatment should work so quickly and exactly what does it do. We know for a fact that ketamine has its effect through um, affecting glutamate system, a different neurotransmitter from serotonin, norepinephrine, and dopamine, previously thought uh, to be implicated in major depression. Uh, it affects something called NMDA receptors uh, that you know, basically modulate uh, the activity of glutamate. Safety of ketamine has been established in decades of worldwide use. Ketamine is considered an anesthetic that is safe enough to be administered by non-physicians. In many countries, like for example in Israel, ketamine is used by first responders um, when uh, paramedics or other paraprofessionals are responding to a minor trauma. In America, ketamine is frequently used by dentists and um, surgeons and physicians who are interested in ultra short um, sedation uh, without um, the use of uh, intensive care. Ketamine has gotten a bad name um, and a bad reputation due to ketamine abuse by some of the uh, club users of ketamine. Um, those users use 20 to 30 times the doses that uh, we are considered clinical and sometimes use the very poor grade or the veterinary grade of ketamine in order to get intoxicated. How does Trifecta use ketamine to treat treatment-resistant depression? Well, we carefully select appropriate patient and then the medical team follows the patient during uh, the injection. We divide the injections into two. The initial very small injection just to give a patient a taste of what it feels like to be under ketamine and also to make sure that there is not an unusual reaction of any sort whatsoever. And then it's followed by the second dose. Uh, the dose we use is about one quarter of an aesthetic dose so we don't expect the patient to be asleep or heavily sedated. Um, usually people respond to a rather pleasant experience of being mildly intoxicated. We pre-treat patients with Lamictal if they can tolerate it and that prevents uh, something called emergence reaction which is feeling very very intoxicated during uh, the ketamine infusion. Uh, we typically administer ketamine um, by giving it as a shot rather than an IV because we find it to be equally effective and saves the patient the trauma of uh, having an IV uh, placed in their arm. We monitor EKG, uh, blood pressure, um, other vital signs and pulse oximetry just to ensure patient's full uh, safety. Usually the procedure takes one hour to hour and a half. We make sure that by the time the patient is discharged from our office, 
that they're fully oriented, not intoxicated, and know where they're going. Um, usually, a person can expect to be surrounded by uh, pleasant and concerned medical professionals um, in a rather nice and uh, quiet office setting. Uh, some patients choose to take a little nap during the infusion, others choose to talk. Uh, usually patient can expect to be mildly intoxicated but not delirious and can expect to remember most if not all of the session. After the effects are gone, the person can expect to be feeling back to themselves again. Some patients report feeling better right away. Um, others feel better and are relieved from depression by the next day, but the vast majority of patients do improve following even one ketamine injection. At Trifecta, we do everything possible for our patients to achieve rapid and successful treatment. Uh, with results that last. We do use innovative techniques and ketamine is just one of them, but overall you know, we're a clinical and not a research facility, so we're less concerned as to why treatments work and more concerned that they do work and each particular individual is satisfied with the results. We don't believe that treatment-resistant depression should be even possible or frequent and we don't take any failures lightly.